Hello everyone. In this session, we will understand types of classes in C Sharp. We already covered up the abstract class and abstract method, but in this session, we will understand static class and static members or static methods. Let's get started. So basically, static uh, static class uh, is a kind of class where you can declare only static data members or static methods. You cannot create non-static member or non-static method see if i have let me increase the font so if i have one class over here class let me take sample as my class and inside this class sample i have public uh, string str or let me take one method first of all public void add method and i try to int x and int y okay now let me take another class here class uh, let me take sample uh, one and inside this class i will take my static void main method and i try to call this add method here how i can call with the instance of my sample s equals to new sample basically and i will try to call here c s dot add i can call easily no problem right i can give the values or give the parameters no problem i can access this but now see if i make my class as static so if i am doing the static class now if you just see the thing if i build my solution you see cannot declare an instance member in a static class so basically you cannot you cannot create non static method here because your class is static you cannot create them. only static members or static methods you can create inside so if i now do something like this static now it will run no problem see it is going to build success successfully see build one succeeded no problem so first thing what we learn about this that if your class is i mean non static then non static members are non static method you can call that right if your class is static that is your class is static then your method or members is also going to be static okay so that's the first thing that we have to understand when you when you use static class or static methods then you cannot create the instance of the class so now your class is you know this is actually you know the method is static and class is also uh, you know static now let's me try console dot right line and just want to add these two value x plus y this is the implementation that we want right so if i want to do that now as your class is static you see if if you if you do something like this sample s equals to new sample and you create the s dot add see you cannot call your add method even though if you remove uh, you cannot remove that right so you cannot call you see s dot there is no method at all let me magnify it you cannot call the method see add s dot add you cannot call that so now what second thing we need to learn when your class is static you cannot create an instance of your class you cannot create the instance of your class how can I call this add method then? Thing is, when you're having static class, you can directly call with the, you can directly call this add method with your sample. I mean, with your with your class name, you can directly call that. So if I write here sample dot, you see, you can directly call the method sample dot add. Now you can directly pass those values. No problem. Okay, this is valid. And this is going to build successfully no problem okay so your class is static then you cre cannot create the instance of your you know class so sample s equals to new sample not gonna work in your main method this is not possible so what, what exact how exactly you can uh, call this method with the help of class name sample dot add you can call that right so that's the thing that we need to learn so let's uh, you know complete our uh, or let's create a complete program on static class and static members okay so i have this method here and uh, let me uh, 
let me just you know do something else instead of this adding and division let me create some members here see public and then i'll say public static let me have public static string str and this is going to be my static class member this is static class declaration just like that okay let me take another method that is public public i'm um, sorry public static and let me take uh, a void or let me say uh, instead of that i can do this as public static void instead of that let me take a method here let me uh, let me take add method here no problem so this is the int x and int y okay and uh, let me create this method as let me implement i'll write something called as implement let me say add is and x plus y okay now this is going to be you know one we had taken one data member that is declared and then we had taken static uh, method add method and we tried to call this this met this member and this method inside my main method of another class so how can i call if you create sample s equals to new sample it gonna give you an error you cannot call any member or you cannot call any um, your method you cannot call you even cannot call your member you even cannot call your method so this is not possible if you try to build what it says uh, yeah first let me just write the incomplete thing add and 10 and 20 if you want to pass this value if you try to build what it says cannot create declare uh, let me uh, what it says yeah cannot access with an instance reference okay it, it, you cannot create it, it cannot be accessed with an instance refer reference it's easy right Quali uh, qualify it with a type name instead qualify it with a type name and type name is what the sample class okay you, you can call all these method and members with the help of just typing your class name so let me see how can i do that so console dot right line and now i want to uh, print this 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 member so i will say sample sample is my class name you can see where it is declared static class name so static class name sample so i'm i'm, I'm saying sample uh, sample sample dot and I, you can see i can access that data member string sample st, dot str so the data member work is done now what i need to call this add method how can i call sample dot add easy okay so i'll say sample dot add now i need to pass those 10 and 20 so let me pass that now control shift p successfully build it now if i run this it will run no problem see static class declaration that is the static uh, you know uh, that is the static member that we had declared in the sample class and the sample class is static class you can see here see static class sample and we had declared that and the same result we got static static class declaration and then the add method that is also static and you can see the result is 30 and how how we fetch these values with the help of class static class name not the instance of that sample class we haven't create any instance okay we haven't create see have we have we created no we directly call this data member or, and this method with the help of static class name sample.str and then the sample.method. So keep that in mind whenever you're having a static class, then, then you need to create the, uh, then you need to uh, create the members or the methods as static, not the non-static. You cannot create that. Second thing, if you want to call these members and the method, you can directly call it with the help of static class name not by instance of that class okay that's not possible i hope you understand it thank you so much